It's become a real ma- Oh! Hello again! What's up? Well, that's creepy. You're here about the black fox? Wait, what do you mean? Hmm... I knew the woman who was killed. She was... my aunt. Huh? What? Huh? Wait, if she's your aunt, she's gotta be. She has to be. Yes, that's correct. She was Uncle Taka, I mean, the Thane of Saronia's wife. Hang on. If that's a coincidence, it really is creepy. Tell me, why do you need to find that black fox? You wanted to share its lives? Well, good luck with that. I figured... not the sharing type. It doesn't matter. We should still try to get our hands on its prismarium. Then why not let me help you out? I can take you to where the fox is. Refia, are you sure? Yes, I'll be fine. And Rain and Lon will be there. Whoa, whoa. Let's not forget I'm going to. Oh, of course. Goes without saying. Mm-hmm. That's more like it. Okay. Well, you be careful out there. Hmm. Oh, and you don't have to turn into a cat and follow us this time. I know, I know. Just get going. So, uh, where is this black fox hiding out? It should be in Icicle Ridge. There's a path, separate from the one that leads to the harbor. It's a little harder to find. Well, why don't I go on ahead? See you at the entrance! Over here. Dude! We never would have found this. This is the place where he lost her. What the? It's coming from over there! Hurry! <laughs> Why? That mirage? Why do I loathe it with every fiber of my being? If you were my Uncle Taka, then of course you would despise that mirage. Hmm? Is that Refia? And you? Uh, hiya. <laughs> Once again, I feel the pull of destiny. Boy, am I really not glad to see you. Tell me, Refia. Why is it natural? I would hate that thing. You can tell me first. Who am I really talking to? Me, a knight of the Bahamushan army. 
But this flesh I inhabit belonged to the human you so lovingly called Taka. His body? Then you've possessed him? So, then, where is he? Dead for quite some time now. <gasps> Monster! Is that what you consider honor? Oh no. Those are the rules of this world. The human body is a weakness, the door most easily breached. <sighs> Enough of this. You will answer my question. Why do I bear such incredible enmity for that mirage? That guy whose body you're camping out in? His wife was killed by that mirage. If you look at that fox and feel hatred for it, it means his memory... No. His soul still lives on inside of you. That's absurd! No trace of him could remain. And yet... The hatred inside of me... It is unmistakable. <laughs> oh, I see! Another twist of fate! Yes! Of course! And your arrival is one of the resulting cakes! I see it! Fascinating! Let us test this portentous bond and see just how fast it holds! Uh-oh. If we let that karmic kook find the black fox and kill it, won't that ruin all of our chances? Ugh. Let's go after him, Rain! Right! We beat him to it! This the culprit we're after, Seraphie? Well, it does look exactly like Tama does in her more regal form. Alright, then let's imprison it! Oh, but don't forget that it has multiple lives. For now, forget about imprisoning it. You should focus on defeating it. Alright, then that's what we'll do. Lon, you ready? Right on! And then it can give us its souls! <laughs> All you need now is a hood and a scythe. Given way to something far worse. That's Uncle Taka. What he would feel. My uncle would never hurt anyone, not even a fly. And he never tried to take revenge for my aunt. No matter how much you hate someone, when you lash out, it just leaves you empty. 
He always said so. Empty. So this is how it feels to be human. Watch out! If it's like Tama, we have to assume this thing has got nine lives. Well, how many does it have left? No wonder the thing wouldn't die, no matter how many times I killed it. <laughs> so be it. <laughs> See that? Lon, these shiny things must contain the Black Fox's lives. Dude, nice! So, it seems this body, and with it my soul, must expire. It's down to two lives. That's all you left it with. You must have had a grueling fight. And yet I have nothing to show for my great struggle. Nothing at all. <sighs> and now, it seems, my time to leave this world has come. If I may ask you one favor. See, this man is buried alongside his beloved wife. <sighs> okay. I will. Did Refia leave already? Yeah. They're going to hold a proper funeral in Seronia. Gotcha. Well, Refia's a strong girl. She's gonna be all right. Anyway, I suppose I should head over there and make myself useful. You going on all fours? Like I told you, it's very simple. Cats get around? You know it. So, who wants to go back to Ninewood Hills and bring that girl the QB lives we got like the bad mom bombs we are? Sounds good.